EFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Hello everyone, Basil Chapman here on this Thursday, the 7th of July. This is the Tiger Financial News Network market update at 10 o'clock. The Dow is up 227 at 31,264. And that's really important. We need it to be above the doji candle of yesterday. I'd like to close above it. And what's really important in the S&P, which is also up, the Dow is up 0.74%. The S&P is up right there. Is up. Why does it keep doing that? SPX.X. That should be simple. Uh oh, got a problem. Um, let's see what's going on over here. Uh, let me just run the numbers as I see them. I think I changed that, changed that, changed that. Oh, get rid of that. All right, so status, we're going to change that. I'll just close it for now. I'll get it all. This is the daily chart that's blank. I hit something incorrectly. The S&P is up 30, 34 at 3879, a nice uh, candle up 8.87%. 8 the QQQ, and this is really important because yesterday the QQQ was acting much better than the other indices. It was really in positive, and today it's up 0.95%. Uh, 271 at 291. IWM, the Russell 2000, is up 1.74 percent, up three at 174. Not bad action. Ha! Huh, here's the issue: gold should be having a bounce, and in fact, it is. It's up 10 points at uh, 1747. It's really important that 1800 area is strong resistance. We'll see how that's handled, and we're looking at the dollar. The dollar is pulling back a little bit here. It is down just four ticks at 107.05. And leg D in the weekly chart. Whoa, this is going to be very interesting to see how we close out the week. Crude oil is up um, $5 at 103.45. In that rectangle, remember I said it's stuck in the rectangle formation, having a consolidation, just trading between the lows and the highs. We'll see how it trades out on Friday at the close. And the TLT, which is really important because it's the bonds, down 19 uh, pennies at 114.59. It just can't get above that 118.62 weekly uh, 14 period moving average. I'll be back for the Tiger Technicians Hour in a moment. Looking forward to it. There's a lot to discuss. I'll fix a little problem with the daily chart in a moment. And um, there's a lot going on. Check out our opening call. We've had some really nice trades over the last week and um, could have paid for your subscription. I'll be back in a moment. See you soon. Hope you can stay.